Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. This is a general energies reading for the star sign of Pisces. All right, my beautiful Pisces, when I did your yearly, the card for this month was death. Could be dealing with a Scorpio, but this is huge, hugely transformative month this month for you. We're just going to get some clarification on that for you before we get into the tarot. Hey, advice on this death card, please, for Pisces. Forgive and forget and seek hidden treasure. Okay, let's get into the tarot and flesh this out. So something's happened that's come to an end here. It's time to forgive and forget. To forgive yourself to forgive yourself for being in the situation of some kind here there is hidden treasure to be gleaned to be learnt from this situation coming to an end though but we'll figure out what that is so Pisces what do we have okay yeah okay somebody said something in a little bit of an immature way had a lot to say that weren't really thinking it through time to leave that in the past all emotional issues in the past okay you can't change what happened in the past all you can do is change how you react to it so yeah something has been said and said without thought as i said so yes leave that in the past move away from it the only way you're going to find peace and happiness again is to move away from it forgive it forget it and head towards your own happiness could be dealing with a cancer too but could have been something that was said at night or last month it's got you in a very emotional state and into a state where you may not realize just how emotional you are about it could have had something to do with drinking you thought there was loyalty there but under the light of day basically you've realized there may not be the loyalty that you had hoped you could have had a falling out with a friend a lover family member or two friends here and you've just decided to go it alone once again be careful of not over drinking at this time you're finding you're having to guard yourself against somebody that person that may have had your back in the past may no longer have your back and you're having to look after yourself now you're very strong and capable to be able to do this you may not feel like you want to do it but you're going to be able to look after yourself balance the duality inside yourself the male female part the dark the light this is going to really help with you being able to look after yourself through this i think you envisioned being with this person to a very long age this is a relationship but it looks like it's come to an end you may have been very happy and joyful when you were younger but there's been a big transformation not just of yourself but this other individual and the relationship and the hidden treasure basically is you're finding yourself at this time you've been able to step out on your own to make your own decisions to go your own way take very very little from the past particularly emotional baggage of any kind and this is going to free you up to be able to make more positive life choices in the future very difficult transition i understand that very hard but there is something very exciting in your not too distant future 
it could be an Aries, but you're definitely or a Libra, Aquarius, or Gemini. This will bring you back into your power to be complete sovereign over your own life. It's going to make you feel very grounded and it's time to clean the slate. You could be, feel, be feeling very steely, as in a little bit cut off from your emotions and more in your head. Feeling very confident about yourself and you may want to speak your truth very loudly and clearly here. But your emotions are still very confused. Which way do I go? What do I do now? What's going to happen? Through getting together with friends, you may be able to step back into the more light side of yourself, but once again, careful of excess, particularly when you're in an a emotional state. But in the not too distant future, you're stepping out of this situation and into total happiness. Happiness in your home, happiness with friends, happiness with family. And it may not seem like that right now, but this massive transition and change that's come in, it looks like out of your control, is leading you on this path of not just being able to love and care for yourself, but also to end up in a much happier place. We'll get some clarifiers here with the love blocks that might be affecting you at this time. Thank you. Playfulness. Yes, it's really important when I saw this card here, it's really important to start to enjoy yourself again, to start remember what you really like to do. Life is too short to be too serious. It's really important to start to get out and not necessarily get out, but to start to play and enjoy yourself. Independence is now yours. Being independent does not mean you have to be alone. Once you start to reconnect with yourself and start to love yourself again, you're going to find that you are going to be able to independently be able to get back out into the world, but also embracing friends, family and other work colleagues, anything like that. You're going to find that you're not going to be alone for very long, that's for sure. Your strength is going to attract so many people. All right, so we'll also get a affirmation here for you. So yes, massive transformation. It looks like you're having to defend yourself from people that you thought you'd never have to defend yourself from. Big change in a relationship that came um, in very quickly. You thought at one stage when you were younger, you were going to last forever, but it doesn't look like that has been the case. It's now time to enjoy your independence, to actually get to know and love yourself again, to start to feel joy in your heart. Three popped out. Wow. Okay. I've only been doing one for the others. So here we go. I trust the intelligence within me. There are no problems that do not have a solution. There are no questions without answers. With every breath I take, I'm getting healthier and healthier. My body is a mirror of my inner thoughts and beliefs. I nourish it with good foods and healthy exercise. And last but not least, I use my words and thoughts as tools to shape my future. Life is very simple. I create my experiences by my thinking and feeling patterns. What I believe about myself and about life becomes true for me. How do you feel about yourself? Pisces, it's time to forgive and forget anything that happened in the past. Seek the hidden treasure within. Love your body. And realize that life is very simple and easy. Okay, I really hope that helped. Just a quickie. I'd just like to say thank you so much. I love you all and...
Bye for now.